Welcome, 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 welcome. Let's do raw love. We're going to do now until the end of December. Let's do Aquarius. Aquarius, my aqua babies. Good morning, good morning. So, rest of December. Rest of December, Aquarius. Well, they're being super particular with Raw Loves this week. I will tell you that. It's so bizarre. It's so bizarre. Can we get a card for my Aquarians? Can we get a card for my love buggies, please? Are we going to wait? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? One card, please. One card for my Aquarians. And I hear music, it makes me dance. Whoa, whoa. Okay. You got the king of water. Okay, you got justice at the bottom of the deck. Um, it's time to definitely, most definitely make a decision. Okay, and stand up for what it is you want. Um, you have the emperor right underneath, so I don't think you're going to have trouble taking leadership. Um, structure, discipline, that type of stuff, using logic, okay? Um, but to me, the way this is looking right now, honestly, I, put, I kind of feel like you're like, eh, do I want to, though? <laughs> Look at them looking at each other. You know? Um, so I, it, looks, it looks like you kind of have to make a decision that you kind of don't want to make. Um, but ultimately, you're coming in as the energy, as, you know, the king of water. So what this is asking you to do is pretty much open up your heart chakra, okay? Um, you do have people around you that are trustworthy, okay? And uh, uh, filled with heartful, heartfelt advice, okay? Whatever this is can, can work if you want to make it work. If you want to make it work type thing, okay? So... When I hear music, it makes me dance. Where are you going? Where are you going? So, I definitely feel like there is some type of decision that you're contemplating. But, you're solid with it. So... I don't know if you're worried you're not going to get the respect you need or the trust you're looking for. Um, if your heart's open enough for you to be compassionate enough about the situation, because, I mean, of course, you know, I think sometimes the emperor carries a bad name. People kind of look at him. I know some of, some of my guys do, like meaning you guys, you know, look at it like, you know, sometimes you could be stubborn and impatient harsh, you know, but in all reality, the emperor is somebody who's, who's very grounded and has their shit together. Um, so to me, it looks like with you, my Aquarians coming in as the king of water, you know, it seems to be a little bit of a challenge. Um, you're slowly figuring things out. Um, Nine of Cups, too, with the Seven of... Oh. 
Ooh, look at all these tents, all this green. There you are, the king of air. That's too many. Uh, I'm going to take them. No, I'm not. I wasn't feeling them. One was the counselor, though. Which means, you know, with the council right there, that means you're talking to somebody pretty high up. Um, not in this realm type thing, okay? It's not, it's not really judgment. It's, they got a lot to say to you. Um, it's, it's not really a judgment. It's where they want you. Um, and can you agree to it? Can you be okay with it? Can you do the work that needs to be done? Um, queen of air. So, and that's side by side. Okay. So you got a, you got a partner and the queen of water with the king of water. Holy crap. And then you got the mother at the bottom of the deck, which is like the empress. Okay. Hold on a minute. Sorry, I needed a sip of coffee, but it was right there. All right. So the Nine of Cups. See, this one, I, I feel like you're worried about... I feel like you're worried about the household. You know, this could be... Sometimes it's... Um, like in the medieval, it would be household. But, like, historically, this one's like the traditional branch. So it's kind of like Judgment. Okay, and you have justice right here. So you seem confident when it comes to something. You're holding on. Here's the thing. You hold. It looks like you're holding on to the queen of water. All right. But this isn't really, you know, it's not telling me too much because basically it's just telling me, you know, that I don't know if there's two women in your life or two men in your life because you got two kings and two women. Okay. Um, but I feel like it's talking about one energy. You're holding on. You might be, I think you're holding on to the queen of water. Okay. But what's happening is the two of you are in the energy of air making practical decisions. You're holding on to somebody who, who's got a lot of love for you. And if you do go in, to this person, this queen of water, because you're taking on the energy of the, the king, you, you got a court couple. You got you kind of got a life partner here, you know, um, or a best friend type thing. But like I said, with the two of these together, it, it's you're waiting because that's a 12, which is a three. You're kind of waiting. You're putzing around. If you ask me, it, it, I mean, this is telling me right here, you need to make a decision. Like... Your, your own judgment call, all right? And it, it's all about making a decision. I mean, it, it's it's clear as day. I mean, I guess I can I can dig a little bit, but the two of you, the two of you are flying. The two of you saw. It's like, it's a match, okay? And if you guys both have this conversation, because you're holding on to her, clear as day. So when you both have this conversation, what they're asking is for you to come in as the king of water. And if she's already the queen of water and you're both using your brain, you're both using your heart, you're definitely using your spirit with the eyes. Okay. So it's mind, body, spirit. It's, it's beautiful. It's, it's like the trifecta. Okay. This just got really loud. Um, so there's really not much to clarify. Oh, okay. Well, those just flew everywhere. Hold up, buttercups. And the song is uh, In My Eyes. Okay, so you're holding this person dear, dear to you. It's just, it's mind-blowing because there's, there's nothing to dig into except for you making the decision. But nothing here looks bad. It looks like you most definitely have enough confidence to approach this person. And you're coming in as the nine of pence. You're solid. You've been holding on to this person. You know? Um, 
let me just make this a little darker. Okay. So you're holding on to her or him. Okay. Or my Aquarians legitimately have either two men or, or two or two women to choose from. But I don't see it that way. You could be dealing with a business partner. And even if you're dealing with a business partner, or you guys are going to go into business together, um, you make me feel. See, somebody doesn't know how somebody makes somebody feel. So it looks like you're holding on to this woman and not even and telling her how you feel. But it looks like it could be a potential business partner here. So tell me about the four of pence, Aquarian. Four of pence, four of pence. It's so it's so um, clear cut. There's there's no one between here. It's just a matter of going, talking, rounding it. Yes, the Knight of Pence. Okay, so it looks like you're going. It was just one, two, three, moving forward. All right, you're not, you're not really moping. But here's the thing. This horse looks tired. Your ego definitely got in the way. It's taken a long time. All right, but your back's not turned to the situation anymore. So to me, this has been a long time coming. You know, and it is going towards all this. So it's like, I don't know if you just got done battling something, but um, you're going towards it. Uh, tell me about this queen of water. This queen of water is whatever it is. You're holding on to this queen of water for sure. That's too many. Queen of water, queen of water, queen of water. It's the emperor, all right? You've been turning your back towards her or him. I'm reading by the gender on my cards, okay? And the emperor's underneath. So it's kind of like, yeah, that that one has been lit. It's It's been time for you to go. You've been putzing for those who have been putzing. But it, it's still, you guys, you're coming, you're coming in as the emperor, but they want you to... They want you to take on the energy, the qualities of the king of water, okay? So, this is clean cut. I don't really need to dig. Whatever this is, they want you to go and justify it. So, I mean, it's so clear cut to the point where there's there's no way you don't know what this situation is about. Okay? I got the nine of swords looking right at me. So, you're just a little worried. Not sleeping, apprehensive. You know, you're coming in as the page. You definitely want to go. And the four of wands is right underneath that. Okay. So I don't see. I don't. And I just said it when they're saying, what do you see? Um, in my eyes, it, it's the eye thing again. But you guys, you guys know each other very well when you look into each other's eyes. It, it's clear as day. Okay. You've been holding on. It's been a long time. You had to leave something behind. It's clear as day. Because it looks like you're coming in from like a battle, to be honest with you. Um, it looks like lower energy. And I, I normally would never say that about the, the King of Pence. I mean, the Knight of Pence. But in all reality, this, this Knight is tired. Uh, let me just clarify the Knight of Pence. It took a while for you to... Whoa, whoa, whoa. It took a while for you to get your... Um, courage maybe or your your grounding you know i feel like you just went through something for sure tell me about this knight of pence yeah you're going knight of wands and they usually go in quick all right and it looks like you know you're on a white horse so it looks like you're going in with good intention all right before see this is what you just got out of so i i knew you would go you got out of something because i mean that don't look great all right, but here you are now. So you're about to deliver a message. And the way the horses are going at each other, it's like something is about to, um, like a little fire lit under your butt. You know, because in all reality, the fire's the fire is already lit right here with the emperor. You just haven't done it yet. You know, it's just like, what are you waiting on? So 
you're going in with good intention. When these are together, this one gives time. Okay, a lot of people are like, oh, in and out, in and out, but nah. This is it, it's pure. It's a white horse. Okay. So it looks like my Aquarians are going towards a queen, a queen of um, cups. It hasn't happened yet because you're not making the decision. So I don't know if you were just waiting on this energy or if this is the divine saying, choose this energy. Okay. Um, get you one of these cards real quick. Additional messages, best advice, that type of thing. Aquarius, for the spread, please, Aquarius. So you got you got a decision to make. Yeah, well, it looks like you're going. I mean, this is a message. Unless you could even be going to the Nine of Pents. She, that could be her because she's the queen too. And you got another seven. So it's like you're definitely getting on your path. It's the Five of Swords. Don't feel defeated. I know you look tired, but don't, don't do it. Stay on the horse. Keep going. Okay. And, and you look kind of like, eh, you're not too happy. All right. So I don't know what that's all about. I'm not going to dig. You, you, my Aquarians know exactly what this is about. Okay. So don't you dare feel defeated. I mean, you have somebody, I don't know if you're like, ah, because you're dealing with somebody who's no joke either. She can also be a mother. She's very compassionate. She's caring. Whoever this woman is, and you have the empress at the end, and bottom of the deck, so she, she might be a mother too. But I'm telling you, whoever she is, she knows how to nurture stuff, and she's not dealing with bullshit. But you're coming in as the king. As long as you come in as the king of water too, you're good, because you got a lot of strong qualities, especially coming in as the emperor and the king of air. All right, so you need to kind of be gentle in this situation, if that makes sense to you. All right, I love you guys. Have a fantastic rest of December. Bye.